Your time now is 7.07. .07. Happening today, many communities around central Indiana will honor those who lost their lives on September 11th. The video here shows the 9-11 Memorial downtown, which is made up of the beams from the Twin Towers. 21 years ago today, two planes hit the Twin Towers in New York City. A third plane hit the Pentagon, and a fourth was taken down in Pennsylvania. The attack killed nearly 3,000 people and was the catalyst for a two-decade-long war in Afghanistan. Also today, from sunrise to sunset, Governor Holcomb is directing all flags to be flown at half-staff in remembrance of the victims who lost their lives on this day. Also today, you may notice other people showing their support in the annual tradition of waving the American flag over the interstate, as you're seeing here. Now, there's quite a few events taking place today, like at the Indianapolis International Airport this morning. Starting at 8.40 this morning, the airport will host its annual Patriots Day ceremony. This will take place in the Civic Plaza, where a piece of the World Trade Center steel recovered from ground zero will be on display throughout the day. We'll also have a preview of that event coming up in our next half hour. In Columbus, a moment of silence will be observed in remembrance of the attacks, followed by a ceremony. This will include an emergency responder radio dispatch to honor the first responders and citizens that lost their lives. Members of the Columbus Fire and Police Department's Color Guard will take place in the ceremony. The Columbus Fire Department will also be hosting a blood drive with the goal of collecting 30 blood products. This is taking place at Columbus City Hall. Blood drives. It will begin at 8 a.m., then the mo moment of silence at 8.46 this morning. Now, there are plenty more events taking place around central Indiana today, and you can find a list on our website. That's fox59.com.